Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Kelvin Johnson. In this video, I'm going to show you how to shrink a volume in Windows 11. So let's say you, you've installed Windows 11 on your laptop or desktop and you want to actually create an extra storage or you want to shrink your C drive. So if I go to my, just right click your start menu and then go to computer management or you can actually just go directly to disk management it will actually take you to where you can manage all your different disks that have been configured on your device so right now it's trying to actually load the this configuration information and you can see we have different disks here first of all we have the C drive and the C drive you can see if I go to my let me go to file explorer so if I go to this PC I just click on that and you can see here it says i have i still have about 75 gigabyte free so but i can still create actually a disk from this um local disk so just mind you you cannot actually do that from my right clicking on your c drive or maybe for that i can show more i can actually do that from the properties of this c drive what you need to do is you need to go to your disk management so what i can actually do is i can actually here you can actually shrink this volume by shrinking this volume it's going to actually create volume for available shrink space please wait so it's going to check how many space do we have and how many space can we actually create from this so i'm just showing you this because you can see that i have extra some other disk actually attached to this device but in the case you only have just one disk and you want to actually create an extra space for example just the way i did what i did here for example to have a different h or s drive or different disk drive where you can actually save information so let me go back again to my disk it's actually trying to query and see how many uh, disk space i have let's just wait for some seconds for that to really take place so here you can see that this is about almost 130 gigabytes of this so we still have about 77,000 or 77,000 gigabytes free so what i can do is let me just try to enter about um let me just enter 5,000 about 5 gigabytes and let me just shrink that and let's see how many space we can actually create from that Now you can see it says we have unallocated 4.8 gigabyte but mind you when you try to actually shrink about 5 gigabyte of course there are some other space like the system reserve or system recovery that will be, um, will, will be used from that disk and here we have unallocated and now we can now create a new simple volume I'm going to use the whole disk and I'm going to just call this the I and then give this a name let me just call this info and then next and then finish so now it's going to actually format that disk and now we now have a local disk we can actually save our information to instead of actually saving that information to the c drive so you can see that the disk has just been created and if i go back again to my disk you can see i now have the disk called info thank you very much for taking your time to watch this video this video this is how you actually shrink your c drive by by creating a different disk from it and please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more IT videos. Bye.